everyone. I hope that you are enjoying your day. I'm just jumping in here to check the energy flow and see what's going on from our great Yehovah Elohim, who is our salvation, our Yeshua, my everything, and yours if you cry out to him. Uh, so anyway, um, the energy already has been very profound on some readings that I've done. I'm, I started to work on the Capricorn season. I've only done one uh, re uh, reading, which is their reading. It was very profound, by the way. <laughs> so after I get done with this reading, I may do a couple of more. And so uh, keep an eye out for those. I will eventually uh, put those down below in the description box. So if you are returning, welcome back. Those of you who are brand new, uh, listen, I'm just uh, very spiritual. I'm not churchy or religious. But I am very spiritual. I do love Yehovah Elohim. People call him the universe. He's everything. Okay, nothing exists outside of him. He's he's a unity. He's uh, he's just everything. He's the living Elohim of truth and righteousness, and I love him. And anyway, that is who I am connecting with. I just get out of the way. I'm yielded to his spirit. I just let him say what he wants to say. And it's very profound talk here on my channel. Uh, it ain't no messing around. We're uprooting wickedness right up out of the ground. Okay and we're judging a thing. So this is what my channel is all about. So sometimes I get foo-foo stuff, but not really, not a lot. Um, but I love it though when it does come across my table. It's just that I'm here to do a real specific type of work for Jehovah. But anyway, uh, he can speak about whatever he wants. I don't put him in a box because he could never be put in a box. But anyway, let's go ahead and get started. If it's your birthday, happy birthday. And if it is an anniversary for you, happy anniversary for you as well. Let's get started for this reading. I bless you, Jehovah. I, I praise you, I really do, and I just thank you for clear, defined messages of truth, the whole truth and nothing but the truth. We rebuke and bind and block every foul, demonic, wicked, dark energy and force, every familiar spirit, every witchcraft, moaning, groaning, uh, talking to the dead, wizard, warlock energy. We command them to be smushed and crushed right in their head. I just thank you, Jehovah. What do you want to bring out here? We have the pearl. A crystal is here. Okay, a pearl of great price is shown up here. And also the gates in the great city uh, that, were taught, that were taught about in the Revelation was also made of pearl. Okay, um, maybe you like pearls. Um, there's another man or another woman. So if somebody has brought some type of pearls or uh, some some type of um, necklace or something with pearls, Jehovah's revealing that uh, there's another man and or another woman for some of you all. We have um, to seek uh, a common uh, commentary energy is here. Somebody is seeking. Look, we had the, the garment of the high priest the other day, and somebody was seeking answers for spiritual things. Somebody's been searching for something, inquiring of something uh, that they, they you know, are, are trying to figure out, I guess, with this energy. We have um, sprinkle energy is here. Maybe you work for a sprinkler company. I don't know. There's a basin here and a bowl. We've been getting something about bowls lately. It's interesting. Uh, we have travel energy out here. Maybe you travel for your work or you're thinking about traveling or something like that. Now, if there's just another man or another woman, uh, if that could be your sister involved in something, that could be a family member. It doesn't have to be a freaking love affair, but for some people, that is going to be the case, people. We have somebody that's got a beard. They're of older age. There's an elder here. There's a senator here. There's also an ancient aged person here as well, connected to something. Uh, I'm hearing the Ancient of Days, which is Jehovah. Uh, this is a appointed season. To set something or a time or a special occasion, something's being prepared here. We also have temptation that go back to the devil energy. All right, I want to take an oracle card here and see what comes out. There's an appointment here. You know the temptation card. You know. That devil card goes back to um, 
exes. It goes back to sex, drugs, and rock and roll. It goes back to the uh, industry. It goes back to, to, to somebody who's being tested. Somebody is being tested. What do you want to bring out here, Yehovah, for this reading? Um, what seems... Okay, so there's justices here. What seems an injustice is actually going to be a blessing to you. So that's that's beautiful. That's So if you're being tempted right here, this is, and something's happened real devilish. And it's been unjust. You hold it, like I said, he, he turns things around for our good. I don't know if it was this video or not. I just did a video and I was talking about that kind of stuff. So we got shadows of things here. Um, what you promised is to be your... I can't see because I don't have my glasses on. What you perceive to be your dark side holds a hidden treasure. And we have pearls here. Maybe I need to get my glasses on because I really can't see these very well. We also have joyfulness here and something that's wondrous. And, and uh, um, the card says magical. I don't really like that. But something that's like that uh, is about to happen to somebody. Okay, so something supernatural is here. Let me just take the other uh, back side of this. And we have an awakening happening. Yes, and this is a wondrous time of explore, exploration and romance and creativity. Okay, that's positive. Um, let's say you lost a spouse and here comes another man or another woman in your life that's going to be of great price. We could look at that like that. Not everybody's a freaking cheater, uh, but that energy is out here. Some some people are being tempted there. Um somebody's been sprinkled with some type of uh, beauty or something like that, we can take the word sprinkle, or like I said, maybe you work for a sprinkle company, I don't know. Maybe you travel uh, where that's concerned, I don't know. But there's some type of an appointment or something that's also special here um, to be set aside. There's an occasion of something. Um, maybe you're older, for some of you all and so something now is going to be beautiful and you've went through some type of injustice but it's turned out to be if I'm hearing an older love or something like that that something has possibly been an injustice for some people but somebody's had an awakening and um, something's going to end up being precious through this regardless because nothing goes to waste in the eyes of the divine people it just don't to travel uh, to travel, you know, is what we do spiritually every day. We're on a journey. We are on a journey. The sprinkle can go back to uh, if a basin is nothing else but some type of uh, cleansing, washing type of stuff. Then there's a bowl here. Um, somebody's just washing themselves just energetically is here what do you want to bring out about this I'm just pulling cards for this reading just checking the energy uh, hopefully some people have watched those videos for the cardinal fix immutable and people are coming up and changing the energy and that's positive this is why I do the work that I do Yoba likes to tell us of something before it happens so that we can make a choice within it it is, it is to bring the vibration of this planet up. To get rid of the wicked energy that don't need to be here. So the Queen of Cups is here. That is somebody loving and caring and kind. Or that's something that's taken place where manipulation has been. Where there's been an injustice. And something's going to turn out in, in favor of something. Uh, so the Queen of Cups though represents love. Okay. She would sprinkle a little water on something and be able to tap into her intuition to make something right. We also have the Queen of Swords. There's two queens out here, okay? Uh, if this is um, an ex or a, um, somebody who just is real sharp can uh, say, a matter of fact, that's just that, this out goes, or this is witchy type energy in the negative, if that's been injustice uh, that's been around you with something real sharp that that 
has to come out here. There are two queens. This could be sisters. Uh, this could be family members. This could be you. Uh, both sides of yourself. You know, maybe there's been a hurricane going on. Water and air make a hurricane. Um, this is a doctor, a lawyer, a judge. Um, just somebody who is just really sharp here. But somebody's finally had an awakening. And they, they're, they're seeing something for the first time. Then that's positive. Somebody's waking up. Okay, somebody putting a judgment on something. There's some something joyful here, regardless what the temptation is. If you're in the upright, baby, you're gonna win it every time, regardless. There's a purpose and a plan here. Yeah, there's the Empress coming out, and obviously we know that the Empress has all four queens within her. And so these two sides of the Empress, and she's showing two sides. Yov is bringing out pregnancies and uh, generosity through the Empress showing up here. Um, this is somebody beautiful inside and out. Pearls, crystals. This will be somebody who would have... Uh, have um, if you are dealing with somebody in business where there's some type of legal matter that's happened with pearls and crystals and jewels and things like that, then there's apparently a judgment here. There's been a devilish temptation around a situation that's possibly happened on a trip. That's been coming out lately. Somebody's business got stole. She could represent business. Uh, if we got mothers and, and uh, grandparents, because we've got older people here, elders old age here this could be a grandparent and two daughters underneath that energy uh whatever this is we have the six of pentacles this is generosity giving something okay well if, if somebody is dealing with somebody who has been uh, you know if these are three feminine energies and somebody's been generous where pearls are concerned with an, uh, another man or another woman there's some type of uh, legal matter around that then showing up here this is also the six of pentacles goes back to normally somebody's got the scales over their head for something okay so the two of swords somebody's been crossweighed sitting at a stalemate okay so you know obviously somebody's gone through divorces we do have the temp excuse me the um a justice card represents um contractual type things if you are dealing with your ex and your ex is here okay if you've been married more than once and you found somebody who's everything that's here okay if there's been some type of temptation around that you are much older uh, and you've traveled your journey spiritually and had your awakening and you've come through shadow phases of some things and you found a hidden treasure then there's a hidden treasure here for you because so it's here what further energy do we need to know about this reading in the now you have a, what do you want to reveal here about this energy what further information is here so bottom line, it's going to turn out okay if you're standing in the truth. What do we need to know about what's hidden? The writer. Okay, and then there's the gentleman here as well. So that's beautiful energy if this is in the upright and you've just had another uh, masculine in the way of something or feminine in the way of something where there's been an unjust thing then there's going to be some type of communication here this is also a surprise this is messages this is also inventions and so is the empress she's projects right and so there's travel here with the uh writer as well um and then the gentleman obviously is somebody that's significant if there is something that's gone on where there's been competition around the love i'll just tell you that nobody can uh match the empress she holds it all there's only one that has the great pearl of price within her and that's the one who stands in truth okay the queen of swords also has truth within her if she's in the upright okay um again but if these are three actual people and there's been something going on around something nobody can uh match the empress she's got it all she's just got it all she's always pregnant with something beautiful on the inside of her and there is a significant man here or something professional is going on here with law or something else okay there's been thievery around some things um at the same time let me just say the inventions that are here 
that has seemed to be like an injustice. Remember, Jehovah has said over and over, everything that's stolen is going to be returned back to you. So something that was really bad ended up being for your blessing, actually, in the end, because it became something huge with the empress. That's large sums of money type stuff. This is a pearl of great price has come out of somebody else's stupidness. And so, Jehovah, make sure a thing will turn out right for you, okay? So, we have uh, the key and the door and uh, something being unlocked. There's clues here. There's solutions and insights and stuff like that. Yeah, because somebody's having an awakening here, people. It's beautiful energy coming out. Let's take our last message here and then we'll just call this a reading. I might take a rune also. Jehovah, thank you. So the two of cups is here and the ten of cups. That's positive. Something is going to turn out all right. And something's been very much emotional. Okay, they really have, something's been emotional. The dreamer is on the other side of that. That's a clean slate. That's the fool. So something's been foolish. Some, something's been chaotic around some kind of stuff. There's been stress and problems, but it's, it states it's going to turn out to be something positive. What you think is uh, your dark sides actually holding a treasure in the situation for whatever's taking place. It's been a freaking nuisance. The trap ends up getting trapped in the end. Okay? So, the Two of Cups is a relationship that's going to continue to grow closer and closer, whether that's energetically or not. You're always making sure that something's going to come and it's it's going to, it's going to come together. Um, so, that's positive energy then coming out here. It's a celebration type of energy. There's a forgiveness energy showing up out here as well. And um, this is something very much emotional. And there's material needs that are going to be met at states and there's trustworthy relationship. That's positive. Because somebody's been sitting in a stalemate or been put there for a while. There's justice right there as well. Well, I love it. <laughs> there will be justice, people. There will be. I just heard Jehovah say, They who wait upon me will not be ashamed. He's coming. He's coming. He's on his horse and he's coming. Surprise! That's what I just heard. Thank you, Jehovah. So we have the Z which is out here this goes back to um help uh if something has been impulsive in a situation and there was a resistance this goes back to this is the 15th letter which the 15th higher can would be the devil card which was temptation within something but this is a recovery this is a protection that's granted this is a real impediment that can be overcome is what this is. And this is a help and a shield. And Jehovah is our help and our shield. So we have the Z, which would go back to the harvest and traveling. That would go back to the chariot. That's victory energy. Yes, absolutely beautiful. Okay, guys, I just wanted to check the energy. It looks good. It looks real good. Let's keep going. Let's keep energies before us and uh, uh, take the advice of the divine when he brings out the good, the bad, the ugly. Let's weigh it and let's walk in peace because within that, we are going to find the pearl of great price and we'll be glad that we did uh, resist the devil and make him flee in our temptation. It, it'll pay off for you and me every time. Let's keep it on waking up and having our awakening uh, because it's 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 valuable for us to walk that way until next time y'all shalom